I think that New York is the new model for the new concentration camp, where the camp has been built by the inmates themselves, and the inmates are the guards, and they have this pride in this thing they've built. They've built their own prison, and so they exist in a state of schizophrenia, where they are both guards and prisoners, and as a result, they no longer have, having been lobotomized, the capacity to leave the prison they've made, or to even see it as a prison. Of course, the problem is where to go, because it seems quite obvious that the whole world is going in the same direction. Inconceivable! See, I think it's quite possible that the 1960s represented the last burst of the human being before he was extinguished, and that this is the beginning of the rest of the future now, that from now on, there'll simply be all these robots walking around, feeling nothing, thinking nothing, and there'll be Nobody left almost to remind them that there once was a species called a human being with feelings and thoughts and that history and memory are right now being erased and soon nobody will really remember that life existed on the planet. Inconceivable! There have to be centers now where people can come and reconstruct a new future for the world. Actually, these centers are growing up everywhere now. These are all attempts at creating a new kind of school or a new kind of monastery. Islands of safety where history can be remembered and the human being can continue to function in order to maintain the species through a dark age. Inconceivable! In other words, we're talking about an underground, which did exist in a different way during the dark ages among the mystical orders of the church. And the purpose of this underground is to find out how to preserve the light, life, the culture, how to keep things living. Inconceivable! You see, I keep thinking that what we need is a new language, a, a language of the heart, some kind of language between people that is a new kind of poetry, that's the poetry of the dancing bee that tells us where the honey is, where you have that sense of being united to all things, and suddenly you understand everything. Am I going mad, or did the word think escape your lips? <laughs>